Hey guys, so today I'm doing a plan with me on August 1st through 7th. I'm using this kit by Odd Loop. It's called Plant Party, and these are all of the sheets that come with the kit. I wanted to try some white space planning this week, and we're also going to be out of town for most of the week for my sister in law's wedding, and I will be leaving this planner at home, so I thought I would go ahead and pre plan for the entire week. I'm starting off with a half box at the top of Monday and I'm putting one of my Teeny and Bop coffee stickers and I'm just going to write myself a note that will signify to get up early because I have a lot that I need to get done and I'm going to be planning chronologically during this week just to try something new so all of the things that I want to get done early in the morning will be towards the top and things to get done later in the evening will be down at the bottom. So I'm making myself a to-do checklist right now because I do have a lot of things that I need to get done this Monday and you'll see throughout this plan with me I do adjust the stickers quite a bit because this kit is matte vinyl and I am unfamiliar with matte vinyl. There is a little bit of a learning curve to it as opposed to glossy or matte stickers so I kind of learn as I go. I put a little working teeny sticker to cover up the bottom two checklist and I'm just writing myself little notes to print labels and ship my August subscription. Then underneath I'm going to take two of the TV littles and I'm going to stack them one under each other and I'm actually going to cover this up with one of my multicolor daily chore stickers and make myself a little cleaning checklist. So I write four little checks. One is to do laundry, clean the kitchen, do the master bathroom, and then dust. And then underneath that, I'm taking my Teeny and Bob TV sticker because Monday nights are the nights where I have the most TV shows on and I knew it was going to be a pretty busy day with work and I would want to unwind at night. I'm going to do my sidebar next. I'm taking a full box sticker and I'm going to put that on the top and then I'm going to make myself a little sidebar by taking a blank label sticker and on this I'm going to write this week with a checklist underneath and then I'm going to put another blank label for next week and do another checklist. And in this space, I like to just have my main goals for the week and then my main goals for the following week so that I can see them at a glance and make sure that my week is going according to plan. I do struggle a little bit with this sticker, again, just kind of learning a new type of sticker paper. So I'm going to write down my little list and then we're going to move on to Tuesday. For Tuesday, I'm going to start at the bottom. Again, I'm going chronologically, and I knew that Bachelor in Paradise 3 premieres on Tuesday night, so I wanted to go ahead and write that down. And I realized here that I spelled premieres wrong, so I tried to go in and fix it and realized I spelled it wrong in two different places, so I just write an LOL to myself. So I'm taking another TV little, and I'm covering it up with one of my Kawaii Money Stacks, and I'm going to write Payday on it. And then underneath that, I am taking a full box sticker because I knew that most of the day was going to be packing orders and filling orders, so I kind of wanted to mark off a chunk of time that way. Then I take a checklist and I cut two of them and do a mini to-do checklist at the top and then create a third little like reminder sticker underneath. And this is just to remind myself to like finish up work and also prep my videos for when I'm going to be gone and then to take my orders to the post office. And here I'm taking a half box and one of my busy Kawaii Teeny and Bop stickers and I'm just going to remind myself to get it done because I have a lot to do before my trip, but I know that I can do it. For Wednesday, I'm starting with a half box at the top and I'm taking a teeny packing sticker because we are leaving later on Wednesday evening, so that morning I do need to pack up for it. Then I am going to take a full box sticker because most of the day is going to be traveling so I wanted to just mark that off and I put to do across the top because that is the majority of what we're going to be doing on this day so visually I wanted to mark that off and inside of this full box I am just going to write that we need to fly and check into our hotel. This is a suitcase teeny sticker that's unreleased but I think I'm going to release it soon along with a couple other new ones. Under that, I'm taking a page flag along with my sleeping teeny sticker because I am going to try to go to bed early this night because we do have a pretty busy weekend starting the next day. This kit doesn't come with bottom washi, so at the bottom I decided to find a washi tape that kind of fits with the colors. It's not a perfect match, but I feel like it fits well enough for me to use it and I wanted to have something at the bottom. So I'm using my Erin Condren ruler to rip off the edges to make them nice and straight. And I'm just going to do the exact same thing to the other side. 
Starting at the top of Thursday, I'm going to take a half box sticker with another one of my coffee teeny stickers because we do have breakfast plans with Alex's entire extended family on this day. It makes me realize I need some teeny and bop food stickers, so if you guys have any recommendations or requests for a cute sticker that can signify eating or going out to eat, let me know. Then I'm taking a full box sticker and I'm just going to write out what we're going to be doing for the majority of Thursday, which is just hanging out and making some flower arrangements. Then I made a to-do list for the evening because I do have a bunch of things that I need to get done in the hotel room that night because I do have my new releases that come out on Fridays, so Thursdays are pretty busy for me. So I'm just writing out a to-do list to remind myself of what I'm going to need to accomplish on Thursday night. I'm starting Friday off with a to-do checklist because, again, with my new releases posting that morning, I do have a lot of things that I want to get done first thing in the morning over my coffee to just be done with it for the day. Underneath that, I'm taking a half square sticker and I'm going to write in our task for the day, which is a mission that the bride has requested, which is we have to find a bunch of like specialty balloons. I have to get more details on what that is, but I'm just gonna go ahead and write it down. I decide to pull out my shopping bag stickers and put a Target sticker down, even though I really don't think that I'm gonna be able to find these balloons at Target. I just thought it was cute. So here I'm putting a shopping teeny and bop sticker and I just layered a blank header behind it to kind of create a background. I don't know why I decided to switch right to the weekend banner right here but I do and I have a little bit of trouble with this weekend banner as you'll see because it's not exactly the same length as the two boxes so in order to get it centered I pull it up a couple times but I do end up getting it figured out. Friday night is the rehearsal dinner, so I decide to take two of these Littles stickers to use as a background. I layer them one on top of each other for a date night teeny and bop sticker, but I realized that I actually wanted to flip the asterisk because I want to cover it with the date night sticker, but I want it to be on the other side, so it's the opposite side of the shopping sticker, if that makes sense. So I pull it up and I flip it around so that I can put the date night sticker on the right side, if that makes any sense. Again, I need like food stickers because it's a dinner, but I figured a date night sticker would work. Moving on to Saturday, Saturday is the wedding day, so I'm going to take a full box sticker to block off the top of the day and also for Sunday because I just figured I'd go ahead and put the full box down. I'm skipping around a little bit right now. This is not a normal plan with me for me. I was listening to music and just like not even being organized at all. I'm very willy nilly, but that's fine. I take a half box sticker and write wedding day and another half box sticker for Sunday night and for Sunday morning. Sunday morning we have a barbecue with Alex's family before we fly home, which is later that night. So I go ahead and write all of that down. And I put another suitcase teeny sticker down at the bottom because I thought it was cute. For the rest of Saturday, I want to just decorate with a couple of wedding stickers from my wedding deco sampler. And I'm putting another unreleased teeny sticker, which is my drinking teeny sticker because I'm sure there's going to be wine. It's a wedding. And with that, I am all done with the spread. I know the spread was a little bit different than anything that I've ever done. I was in kind of one of those moods where I just wanted to try something new and not conform to any planning rules that I've kind of like figured out for myself over doing so many spreads. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave me your feedback below and I'll see you guys with my next one.